This car here is one of, I think there's five 62 Pontiacs, and they're all different models except for the 62 Bonneville Tudor hardtops he's got. This is the Bonneville convertible. This is one of those really odd cars. It's a 54 Nash, but it has a Continental kit on it. I don't know what other options it's got available on it, but I don't know how they got it back here. It doesn't look like it's been hit anywhere. Hopefully we can get it out in the same shape. And when we uncover it, get it cleaned out, we'll find out what it's missing, what it needs, but this will be ready for restoration as well. Come over here. So this is the reason why we had to bring a chainsaw. We're going to have to get this car out of here, and thank God we have a forklift. This is one of the best cars we think in the group. You never find a 38 Buick that's not missing everything. The side bouncer on it, all the chromes are on it. Look at these lenses are even in good shape. Um, hopefully we can get it out in the same shape that it's in. I think if this door opens, look at the steering wheel on this car. Original radios on the, on the floorboard here. Yeah, just tons of parts on this car. And it's almost like this tree has kind of just kept it from getting screwed up. I mean, it's a really nice, complete car. Over here in the corner, you got to see this. It's a 53 Pontiac convertible. I mean, any convertible is a good car. This has been saved over here for a reason, obviously. It's been covered up. Uh, looks like it's rust-free. Over here, look at this one. This is one my dad wants to keep, I think. It's a 1940 Packard limousine. Look at the steering wheel on that car. All of this stuff has to be moved out of the way for us to get this car out and the Pontiac convertible out. And then we have to bring it all back in when we're done. This is just going to be Okay, um, let me get you over here. Another one of the cool things about this buy is the guy had a bunch of parts. Like, I think these are the same hubcaps for my 60 old 98. Here's a tri power setup. Uh, it looks like probably for a Pontiac. Uh, all this stuff we're going to have to take to the yard, decode it, figure out what it, what it is, and then it's going to be available online. So, check out our website for that stuff. Thanks for checking out our intro video. The fun's gonna actually start tomorrow, so make sure you click the videos below. We're gonna be adding them like every other day, so not gonna be like all at once, but you gotta check out the, the high speed, us getting this stuff out of here. We have to get 18 cars out of here in one day. We're gonna see if we can get it done. Uh -huh.